Oh my god, I did not know my hair looked like that. Anyway, get ready with me to just like not feel ugly because I just wasn't feeling myself today and I turned the beauty filter off so you can see like I'm peeling and I don't know why. I took my concealer there off because it was just like, what's the opposite of eating? Like fucking starving? Also, people were asking what this product is. It's my favorite skincare product in the whole entire world. Wow, I'm really getting vulnerable here with the beauty filter off. I don't know what is going on. Like, right in this area, I don't understand. But I might start saying starving, like, when something's not eating. Because I just, like, said that and I didn't even think about it. And I'm like, oh, I'm in a good mood right now. Like, I don't know what got me here. But I'm, like, happy, I guess. I guess. I left my rare beauty blush at my dad's house, which I always do that. Oh, now I have to use this other blush. And it's just, like, it's cute, but it's not as cute. I'm gonna put the beauty filter on to end with the video so I feel like I look good there we go never mind i'm not done i want to line my lips okay the lips are done i think the reason i wanted to get ready is because Juan's coming over and i wanted like him to think i look good to be honest to be honest but yeah I'm done. bye guys hi guys get ready with me for my stepmom's birthday dinner i only have 30 minutes to do my makeup and change and i'm wearing this new top which is so exciting like the first time that you wear something new is just so exciting okay i know this is really random but i just remembered the bathrooms in my school right now like they were painted or something and it smells like strong paint and it gets me like dizzy being in there like, i like can't stand the smell of paint or gasoline i love burnt wood oh my god i love the smell of burnt wood i love the smell of what was it? Is it canela cinnamon i love the smell of cinnamon I don't know why I just started talking about that. Mom just called me and she's so cute. She was like just checking up and she was like, Hey, how are you? What are you doing? And I was like, I'm making a girl ready with me. I'm trying like this new spoolie I got. Okay, I'm gonna change into my outfit and then I'll do my lips. Okay, I'm going with this necklace that Juan got me and these earrings. Okay, I changed into this beige top because I didn't like how the white one looked at the top. But yeah, I'm done. Bye guys. Hi guys, get ready with me for dinner with Juan and his mom and my mom kind of late because okay before we go eat we have to drop my brother off like at this party that he has and it's 20 minutes from my house but today i was volunteering volunteering uh in elementary school i was teaching the kids how to make bookmarks and this girl recognized me from tiktok her name is ella it was like really cute she was making a bookmark that was like a good experience i get so stressed when i'm being rushed no i just started getting ready I'm doing my makeup, Ale. ¿Quién? ¿Y tú no se encuentras allá? Okay, yo le pregunto. I just called Juan and I was like, okay, my mom has to leave now. And like before I even explained, he was like, okay, so I'm picking you up. And I was like, yeah. And he's like, okay, love you. And I was like, oh, like he knew exactly what I was going to ask. I just need to get dressed. So I'll show you guys the outfit. I've tried on so many shirts. I don't know which one. Like I have this one, but I don't have a bra that goes with it. I have this top, but I feel like it's not like flattering. I don't know. I don't like how it looks on me. Okay, I have this pink shirt. I have the same one in white and green and beige. Okay, I think I'm wearing this top, these jeans, and those shoes. I don't know. Like, I don't love it, but Juan's on the way, and I don't know what to wear. Hi, guys. I'm doing my updated skincare routine. I'm going to take the beauty filter off okay so you can see my skin is getting better and i've been using two products this isn't an ad or anything this is just the only thing that's kept my face from completely like drying up so it's these two aquaphor and however you say that i've been like bonding with my family a lot lately and my aunt had a baby and like it's just so precious i don't know i'm getting crazy baby fever the aquaphor i put it on all the parts of my face that tend to like dry up more it's really just the areas where i break out like right now it's good but i feel like you can still see the redness from before then i put this like on my whole face and actually i lied it's not two products it's three including my lash serum which i'll show after i spread this evenly throughout my face but anyway i started watching the show you and it's kind of like traumatizing but it's really good <laughs> and i'm enjoying it and juan's also watching it at the same time as me so it's fun because we're like talking about it you know not this weekend but the next one i'm having a galentine's day thing with my friends by the way i'm not putting anything on my brows i'm just brushing them and it's just girls and i'm like so excited because i don't know it's gonna be cute we're decorating and whatever i use the ordinary lash serum this is not an ad it's just like my favorite serum because most of them make your eyes like red and puffy or at least mine 
Okay, I'm done. I look so slimy, but this is what works for me. So yeah, bye guys. Hi guys, I'm doing a lash routine. I'm so tired. Like I woke up and I just kept putting my alarm further and further. I'm actually exhausted. I can't do this today. Anyway, I brush my lashes with a dry spoolie and then I get the tweezer man curler all the way at the root and hold it like this and fold it so that my eyelid like this is on top of it. It makes it like flat backwards and I hold it at the root. Sometimes I open and close a little but mostly just hold it for like a good 40 seconds because the curl is the most important part. Okay, then I open it and slowly let go like upwards. Now I'm going to do the same thing with the other eye. I'm doing round two so I'm going to curl this one again. This time I open and close it like this slightly. As I let go, I slowly close it a little like tap it going upwards all the way up to the tips of my lashes so that they actually curl. I'm brushing them and then I'm going to use the Sky High Waterproof Mascara. I do it like really carefully and lightly moving sideways. Kind of like that gently. And I kind of close my eye to give my lashes more space. Mine is on the way to my house. And then I target the end lashes like this just to make sure they're like darker. They're honestly not looking that good today, but whatever. I'm gonna go in on the tips with the telescopic mascara. I think Maya's coming upstairs. I think she just walked in. Let's see. Oh, there she is. Never mind, don't listen to me. My lashes look bad, but yeah, bye. Hi guys, I'm doing my skincare and I wanna talk about my day today. School is not bad. Today's the only day that I have lunch with Amanda, Gabby, and Miranda. Like the three of them are in my lunch today. So that's nice, like it's fun to be with them, but at the same time, Maya isn't in that lunch and Vicky isn't in that lunch and those are like two of my closest friends. So like, it's bittersweet. But anyway, after school, Maya drove me home. I changed chilled for a little and then Juan came he picked me up and we went to Chick-fil-a we were with his two friends and Maya was there and it was nice because I don't know like it was just a good group of people to be with and then I went to Juan's house and I was with his family he got ready for this event that he had at his school then we all went I was sitting with his parents while he was doing his thing it was cute then we went to dinner the four of us and I actually had a really good time I love his parents I don't know I feel comfortable talking to them with a lot of people I don't really feel like myself I don't feel like I can be myself but with them I do and I love it then I spent some time with my dad and I just got back to my mom's and got ready for bed I'm gonna go to sleep as soon as I'm done with my skincare because I was exhausted this morning waking up and I want to be like well rested tomorrow and it's 10 so if I go to sleep right now I can get like eight hours of sleep okay that's it for my skincare bye guys hi guys get ready me Ugh. <laughs> Get ready with me at Juan's house. He just brought me a hoodie. It's on TikTok, bro. My hair's cooked. No, it's not. We're watching the show You because we've been watching it together. Bro, so. it's so good. That show is smacks. Yeah. We're on season two, episode three. I already have my makeup done. I just want to, like, touch up on it because I'm going to, like, a dinner thing. Let's, like, make myself look a little nicer. Basically, Juan went to my house and I was with Maya. So it was the three of us, and I love hanging out with both of them, like my best friend and my boyfriend, like it's just perfect, and they get along, but there was a problem with Maya's car, like it wasn't starting, so we waited for her dad to get there, and he helped. Juan goes, I love you by the way, and I was like, oh, I love you too, and then he was like, this is just so cute, I was like, what it is, and he was like, just being with you, like, you being at my house, and Yo. doing your makeup, and like, oh, my blush went on the sink. I don't know. I just thought it was so cute that he said that. Because, like, I love spending time with him. And that shows that he feels, like, the same way. Like, he also loves it. So, it's like, oh. Me and Juan literally live, like, I don't know. How far do you think we live from each other? Like, seven minutes? Like, five. Five or six. Like, six minutes from each other. And it's, like, so perfect. I don't know. I love it. We think the same. Like, he's talking about how... Most people would just say five or ten minutes, but like we're both so like we have to be specific. I don't know. We like think the same a lot of the time. It's really cute. Okay, put my hair down. I did my lips and we're ready to go. Of course. Peace out, Bye. TikTok. Hi guys, get ready with me. I'm going to talk about things that I love for like moments in life that I love. I love seeing my mom laugh uncontrollably. She just starts dying laughing. Like 
nothing can stop her it makes me happy to see her like that i also love like when my dad is happy like when we go to colombia and he gets to see his family and i can see like his real smile oh my god i love when i'm exhausted and i just lay in my bed and i know i can sleep in and i'm just like falling asleep it's just like ugh. I love when you get back home from the beach and you're about to shower and you look at yourself in the mirror and you see your tan lines and you're like, ah. I love those friends that I can just like take a nap with or just not do anything with and still enjoy their company without feeling like I have to socialize, you know what I mean? I love those moments in which I'm just standing in some public place, like maybe a shopping center or something. And I look around and I see like a bunch of people and it's just like, you see the humanity in the world. I love when you're like in a cold building and you step outside and you feel like the sun's heat and you kind of just like absorb it. My mom calls it like photosynthesizing, I think. And lastly, I love how welcoming my boyfriend's family is to me. How nice they are to me. This makes me feel really good, but I'm done with my makeup. Bye.